Hi, uh, today we're here at the Career Pass Virtual Center, sort of a session that introduces a number of the young people entering and studying material science to people in their careers and what they have to look forward to as they go through their careers and how to plan. We took a format that we had four different speakers. We had people from industry, people from academia, people from our government advocacy committee, and myself from the National Laboratory. Uh, it's a good field for a young person to be in because working in this field can lead to many other directions. There are many directions that uh, come up and uh, the directions change. As a second year graduate student, it was nice to see different perspectives. As I start to consider my career and other um, internships that I may do as a graduate student, it's nice to see the differences between industry and uh, government and academia. So I guess the big thing I got from this is uh, the ability to transition. Uh, because coming into grad school, I thought, you know, I'm definitely going to be a professor. But after a couple of years, I thought, maybe I want to try something different. My main concern always is, like, if I pick one, will I be able to switch out? And Hearing the talk, definitely that seems to be the case. I just graduated from PhD, so it is really interesting to me to know what are the opportunities outside. So right now I'm more into academia, but it's really amazing all the other things that we can do. Like I didn't know about the advocacy, about the government, there is a lot of things that we can do as uh, material science. If you get into a science career, if it's materials research or almost any kind of science, uh, uh, love it and enjoy your career. All the speakers were very lively, very knowledgeable, and it was, it was a good time. And, and if you're doing something and you feel you make the world a better place, that's also a good thing.